We're going to talk about the Code of Federal Regulations and the Federal Register. First thing you want to know is what are regulations um, and what is the CFR. So regulations are official rules or orders having legal force and they're issued by administrative agencies. The regulations are then compiled in the CFR. Uh, and uh, it's only the regulations that are currently in force. They're arranged by subject. And there's lots of places to find the CFR. Uh, on the right-hand side, this is the print version. Uh, the other ones are all electronic. Here's what a CFR citation looks like. Um, the first number is the title. CFR stands for Code of Federal Regulations, of course. And the, sec the second number is the section. But the section also has the first number in the section is the part. And this is important for uh, a researcher because sometimes uh, someone will have information such as 47 CFR 8. Uh, and that's not a pinpoint site. That's just a, 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 a site to the part, which could have a large number of sections within it. So if, you, if, you're look, if you're looking for just one CFR section, it must have a decimal point in it. Um, pretty easy to pull up uh, a citation in the CFR or the Federal Register when you have a citation. It's simply a matter of inputting it. Uh, here we got it, our Westlaw Next box up. Just put it in the box up at the top of your screen and uh, you'll be able to access it. Again, you do the same thing for the Federal Register citation. Do not worry about section symbols. It's not needed to pull it up in Westlaw, Lexis, or Bloomberg. Um, here's a screenshot of the ECFR, um, and you'll, you'll notice on the left-hand side you've got your browse and search options, and that's how you go about finding your individual section. I also want to point out the current date in the middle of the screen, and the ECFR is usually the most current uh, version of the CFR, and it's usually just a few days behind whatever has been published in the Federal Register. Um, if you need to search the CFR, here we are again in Westlaw Next. Just simply type in from the first screen, Code of Federal Regulations, and it should pop up on our screen, and we'll select it, and then we're in the search box, uh, or, or the search screen, I should say, for the CFR. It's simply a matter of typing in uh, your search, as you see up at the top where the arrow is, in the big box, um, or you can use the advanced search options. Very similar uh, on the other services, uh, what Lexis and Bloomberg, etc. So the Federal Register, what is it? Um, well, it's where all the new and proposed regulations are published. Um, they're first published in the Federal Register, then they are incorporated uh, by their subject matter into the CFR. So this is what I was referring to in the ECFR when you have a current date. Um, so if you have, you found a CFR section in ECFR and you know it's current to three days previously, you'll need to, to look at the Federal Register for the last three days to see if that uh, CFR section has changed at all and that's what we call updating the CFR and that's one of the things we're talking about why you would use the Federal Register to update the Code of Federal Regulations um, you're gonna find new new final rules uh, rules and regulations are used interchangeably here um, so when it's first published uh, it, for at least a few days, it's only available in the Federal Register, that individual regulation. You'll also want to find proposed rules within the Federal Register. So when there's going to be a change um, or a proposed change to a particular CFR section, the practitioner needs to know uh, about that proposed change. Here we have the CFR section up in a screenshot from Westlaw Next, and I want to highlight that it, it'll show you where it comes from in the Federal Register. So, every, so when it was created in the Federal Register as a new regulation, or if it's been amended. Um, the Federal Register is arranged chronologically by date. Of course, we, we talked about the CFR being arranged by subject, and it is published daily. Uh, you find the Federal Register in lots of places, uh, as you see on your screen. Uh, my best suggestion for a free website is regulations.gov to get the proposed as well as the final regulations. 
this is what a Federal Register citation looks like, the full citation, uh, the first number being the volume, FR standing for Federal Register, of course, uh, the second number being the page, and then finally the issue date. In our next video in, uh, in our series, we're going to cover updating regulations and further research on a regulation.